with just simple levels of support and resistance we are going to dive into the bitcoin versus dollar on the most important time frames you will ever need and show you the critical prices that you should watch in the next few days weeks maybe years let's begin with the daily chart so in the short term we are still living on the bitcoin chart in the post apocalyptic mode and i'm referring to this ftx spill now some mini trend could be forming here as you can see low high higher low higher high what could be our biggest problem on the daily chart i'm giving you the exact level of eighteen thousand seven hundred seventy six dollars it's september and october it has proven us a fair point regarding the support and you can see how many times the price bounced now when we get if this uptrend is strong enough to that level below nineteen thousand you will see a resistance that I'm talking about because this kind of price station can go unseen. In the short term, this is our biggest resistance. And for now, since we discussed resistance, $16,053 is our line of support. Again, this line of $16,000 proved its worth in the last couple of days, weeks, and could serve us again well until it break, if it does. Because remember, big downtrend is still in play. How big? Let's look at the next chart. When we zoom out on the weekly chart, we are going on this picture all the way to the highs of November of last year. The all time highs for Bitcoin. But that's not relevant for now. Because the same thing, exactly the same thing as we did in short term, in the mid term, are coming out. You can see the line of support. I didn't move anything from the previous chart. So it can be clear that for now, $16,053 will remain that level I am talking about as a big support but not that big the bigger is resistance of eighteen thousand seven hundred and seventy six dollars which i will extend a little more into the past for you to see that for weeks again we are hiding the highest level of support so yes we can go on and on here 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 it doesn't matter for now i want to give you those two levels below 19,000 and above 16,000 and it's something you should remember when we cross any of this we can make a new analysis but this is not a perfect analysis if we don't dive into the biggest of the biggest charts which in reality will tell us did we just bottom or there is more downside to come okay here we are monthly chart the big kahuna chart you can see those levels of support and resistance are nothing in comparison of what we have on the screen so we're gonna remove them or let's say move them to the upside if we want to find the biggest resistance on the big chart that is below 35,000 34,479 dollars when we finish the downtrend when we are again going to the upside this is your biggest problem and you will see that in the coming months but I don't want to talk much about that, something that will happen after we break the downtrend. We are in a downtrend, so is this the bottom? Current price of $17,000. I don't see the signs of it. And let me show you why. In my book, this is the level that is clearly showing us the bottom of Bitcoin, below $14,000, $13,908. Why this one, you might ask? What happened here in 2017? disregard the wicks yes we touched the wicks but have we touched the most important bodies no we have not and those are the levels i just mentioned here monthly chart is showing the big support below fourteen thousand dollars the bodies of the candles but not only that the confirmation came here in the middle of 2019 when we touched that level that i just spoke about as a big resistance so in my opinion bitcoin has not bottomed this could be our bottom that we are waiting for 14,000 below 14 is reality if you ask me you're not but i'm speaking in the next couple of weeks months i think we are going below 14,000, but it's yet to be seen this is my thoughts if this became a reality i hope you will send me some cookies because i am a pretty hungry dinosaur if this was helpful to you how about you follow me into the next one.